This is a different kind of query we're going to try and do again. This comes from the old hire course and the old hire South Lanarkshire pack. What we're going to try and do is set up a query to automatically change numerical data based upon well, a variable or set criteria. This is called an update query. So what we are going to try and do is automatically increase our unit prices by 5%. So let's look back again at this sales database. We want to increase here by 5%. Let's go create query wizard. Simple query. Let's move all our fields across. And modify design. And finish. Again, this should be something you're quite familiar with now. And to access an update query, you have to click on your update tab, which is here. And we want to change our unit price. We want to increase our unit price by and by 5%. So again, our square bracket. And then you need your star symbol for multiply. And if you want to increase it by 5%, it's 1.05. So generally what we've said here is the unit price multiplied by 5%. Again, run your query. And this is how you know whether or not what you put in is correct or not could be a different story. But if you get this message, you're about to update 40 rows. Um, you click yes. And it has been updated for you. It has been changed. So you go back to view. and the prices have increased by 5% that's a little bit more than it was previously so we have increased that by 5% and um, that would affect your table and corresponding data to increase it by the 5% now this is clear clearly your results so to get back to your normal table just double click on close department and you see that it has still increased it by the 5% so not something that's common but still a handy skill to to learn so remember that is an update query an update query again it's important you click on updates that changes the whole layout of your tab thanks a lot hope that was helpful